Greetings, greetings all my dreamers and dreamettes. It's your boy Mickey Fenty, aka Mickey Made It. If you're new to this channel, you know what to do to this channel. Subscribe right now. Also, if you want to support the brand, it's inspiredbydreams.shop. Dress outside of the box. Okay, today's episode is really crazy. You know I always highlight to you guys just how things are going on in people's communities and society. But this one thing that I've seen, this was just topping it all. Now, the news Channel 7, shouts out to Channel 7, you guys know I used to work for there, that's me. Anyway, the news station, they were reporting a deadly shooting, and all of a sudden, there was like these loud noises outside, and things just got crazy. Let's take a look at it and see how it went down, man, and be safe out there, especially when you and your loved ones are going out to work, you gotta keep in contact and watch your surroundings. Sitting in a car, and two men approach. A, what that? I'm was. sorry about that. Yeah, that was a loud noise. I'm not sure what that is. Um, okay, uh, the driver tried to speed away, but police say one of the men shot her in the head. The other woman was not hurt. And just to give you all a little prep, listen out for what's going on while they're talking. So it's going to happen outside of this news station right here. They, one of the men shot her in the head. The other woman was not heard. Um, and police are also looking for another person who shot a woman in the head while she was driving. Please, again, the person shot at Mass Avenue, Sony, maybe to Sony Island. Fran's sister was shot inside a black Jeep. Uh, this happened near 95th and Stony Island late last night. Today, the 24-year-old is in critical condition at the University of Chicago Medical Center. Police say the suspect drove away in a silver SUV. Just want to let you know. And if you notice, things are so bad, they was actually reporting a shooting, a woman in critical condition after being shot while driving. That actually made that noise. That yeah, sounds like a light here in the studio, much louder here, but we're okay. And we'll move. There goes another one, and we're going to make sure... Not okay. sure what's going on here. All right. Um, let's let's call security if uh, if they can check check out if something's going. Did y'all hear the noise when it, I'm gonna bring it back? But did y'all hear the bang? That loud bang. Look at their eyes. It's crazy out there. No matter where you are, things can happen. You have to be very safe, especially when you're dealing and with mental issues and people out there just going crazy. But let's get back into it away in a silver SUV. Just want to let you know that we now know it was a light that actually made that noise. Yeah, it sounds like a light here in the studio, much louder here, but we're okay. And we'll move. And there goes another one. And we're going to make sure, not okay. sure what's going on here. All right. Um, let's let's call security if uh, if they can check, check out if something's going on here. Uh, let's get other headlines here. Craig, thank you. And tonight, Chicago police are looking for a man who threw a rock damaging the window of our State Street studio. Surveillance video shows what happened here. So take a look. You can see the man throw a rock at our window. First of all, there's people out there looking at him. This world is crazy, y'all. This world is crazy. Totally crazy. Check out if something's going on here. Uh, let's get other headlines here. Craig, thank you. And tonight, Chicago police are looking for a man who threw a rock damaging the window of our State Street studio. Surveillance video shows what happened here. So take a look. You can see the man throw a rock at our window. He waits just a little bit and launches it again. He then simply walks away, heading north on State Street. Police are now reviewing this video. The glass to the studio was damaged, but was not broken all the way through, and no one was hurt. This all happened at the beginning of of our four o'clock newscast. Of course, I was sitting right here on the set with Rob Elgus when this happened. Yeah. Um, if you were watching us at the time, uh, you might have been just as startled. I know people were asking on social media if we are okay. The sound was very loud. And for a few seconds there, we didn't know what was happening, but we are all okay. Everyone's okay, but you know, we're right out here on State Street and uh, everyone has to be aware. Yeah, you know? it was scary for me. It them. sure was. And I, you know, I was actually in the makeup room and I heard this and I thought, well, I thought of other things, but there you are. Yeah. Uh, stay safe out there. All right, let's uh, check on our weather right now. What can I tell you, man? People are crashing out. You got to be very safe out there. People are tailored and mental, pe people with mental issues on the street. You, it's not something you can identify by just looking at somebody. And only sometimes you can look at somebody and see that they have mental issues. Only sometimes. Usually, it could be anybody. It could be the guy at the hot dog stand. So you guys got to be careful out there. And 
just know that man the people out there that need help really have to stay away from the people that's trying to get on with their life there has to be some kind of form of protection for the people that's just going out there and everyday citizens just trying to feed their family until next time it's your boy mickey fenty aka mickey made it if you're new to this channel you know what to do to this channel subscribe